வணக்கம் நமஸ்தே ஹாய் மை நேம் இஸ் கிருஷ்ணா ஐ எம் தி பிஸ்னஸ் ஹெட் அட் ஏஎன்டி வீடியோ நெட்ஒர்க்ஸ் ப்ரைவேட் லிமிடெட் விச் இஸ் அ டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபைவ் இயர்ஸ் ஓல்ட் ஆர்கனைசேஷன் ஸோ வி ஆர் த ஓஎம் ஆஃப் வீடியோ கான்ஃபரன்சிங் கேமராஸ் அக்சசரிஸ் அண்ட் வி ஆர் த வேல்யூ அட் டிஸ்ட்ரிபியூட்டர் ஃபார் சம் ஆஃப் தி ஃபேமஸ் பிராண்ட்ஸ் லைக் ஏவர் என்காஸ்ட் யூபிகாஸ்ட் அண்ட் சம் மோர் பிராண்ட்ஸ் ஸோ வி ஆர் லொக்கேட்டட் அட் தமிழ்நாடு மதுரை we have range of uh, products and solutions uh, to offer to our customers so we have about uh, 4000 uh, partners all over india so we do business via our partners so right from uh, web cameras or ptz cameras or speaker phones or microphones or motion tracking cameras speaker tracking cameras so we have a range of products to offer uh, to our customers and uh, in in the solution side we have a uh, different solutions for the different verticals and uh, we are available on a government e marketplace that is uh, uh, gem so all our products and solutions are listed in gem so if your customer is from a government organization so of course you can contact us to get the authorization codes and we will provide you uh, the required uh, product details and we can offer you different solutions and you can bundle it and you can sell it to your customers so today we are going to show a demo of uh, aver vb342 pro a beautiful video sound bar which is kept kept in front of me uh, it has a 4k ptz camera with two powerful speakers with 10 beam forming microphones which is sufficient for a normal uh, mid size conference room so this device comes with uh, various interfaces which is uh, there on the screen you can see that now for the live demo now so let's start the demo now so i am going to show you the unique features of aver vb342 pro which is not there in other brands uh, so let me just start with the features first and then i'll show you one by one so we have a uh, smart framing we have speaker tracking we have gesture control we have smart gallery we have true wdr so all those five features are uh, pretty new in the market and uh, we have all those features so i'm going to show you one by one so let me start with uh, smart framing first so currently uh, this smart framing is enabled in this camera now so i request uh, one person to come inside the frame and you can see how the camera is uh, going to behave so so one person is coming inside the frame and uh, so when he sits the camera takes about 2 seconds to recognize where are the human beings and then it focus both of us right so i request one more person to come inside the frame and sit and you can see how the camera adjusts the field of view so as soon as one more person comes inside the frame camera triggers out and then it zooms in right that is how it works uh, so now it has positioned uh, in a frame where all three of us are there so i request uh, them to go one by one out of this frame so that you can see how the camera is going to behave i request him to go out of the frame now so again the camera will take about 2 seconds to recognize there you go so it focuses uh, on both of us so if he goes out of the frame now you can see the camera will focus to me directly that's it so this is the smart framing for you so the next feature i'm going to show you now is a gesture control so this is one of the important feature where we differ from others so this is running based on ai technology so let me just enable that gesture control and i'll show you how it works now the gesture control is on so gesture control is nothing but you don't have to touch the remote or you don't have to touch the touch panel you know normally which is being used in a conference room to control the camera so the gesture control is enabled now so as soon as you raise your hand like this the ai control will trigger and the camera will zoom into you automatically so you don't have to touch the remote control and uh, you know zoom in manually so if i do like this the camera will zoom out automatically i mean you have to just be like this for 2 uh, seconds not more than that and then you can just uh, put your hand down so if you raise your hand above your head for example the camera will take about 2 seconds to recognize now you can see the camera focus to you now so this is i mean if you raise your hand above your head it will zoom in 
if you do like this, the camera will zoom out. You have to be just uh, like this for two seconds and then the camera will zoom out. So that's gesture control for you, uh, which I'm going to show is Smart Gallery. So to enable the Smart Gallery, you will have to open Aver PTZ app 2 first and then you will have to go to uh, Smart Gallery feature. You can see that on top of it. So as soon as you go to the, go to the option Smart Gallery, you can see the VB342 Pro option here and then just click Start. So as soon as you clicked on Start, you can see two options. One is Headshot mode, another one is Half Body mode. Right. So when you enable this option, so you'll have to go to your uh, video application, which could be uh, Zoom or Teams, and then you will have to select Aver USB VCAM, which is given in the in this page. You can see that, right? So you'll have to launch your VC software and you'll have to choose Aver USB VCAM as a video source to start collaborating. So let me just open uh, my Teams application and then I'm going to show you how this is going to work. So I have a Teams application open. Here if you see, uh, the camera is focusing on us, which is the uh, full view of my room. So I'm, what I'm going to do now, I'm going to put up this video and then I'm going to enable that Smart Gallery features for you now. So I'll have to go to device settings, go to the camera source and select Aver USB VCAM and then Turn on. Now you can see the smart gallery feature here. In one one frame, you can see the whole uh, room uh, video, and then on top, you can see all three of us. Uh, you know, faces are there. For example, now we are three people are sitting in this conference room, so you can see all three of our uh, faces in a different uh, frames inside the single layout. Right? If somebody uh, comes inside for example the fourth or fifth person comes inside and if they sit in a different chair and you can see their uh, uh, you know, frame here in a different uh, layout here so that this is this is what uh, smart gal smart gallery does in the uh, headshot mode now if i select half body mode you can see the difference like this so half mod body mode mode is nothing but you know it uh, it enlarges the video a little bit and you can see like, I mean, it's a half body mode, right? That is what the name is, half body mode. Right? So if there are uh, multiple people comes inside the frame, then of course, the video layout will be adjusted automatically. If there are fourth person comes inside, then uh, on top, there will be three videos. And at the bottom, there will be uh, another uh, video. I mean, if there are uh, six videos, uh, six people are there, you can see three on top, and three or uh, three at bottom. So <clears throat> the smart gallery feature adjusts the frame up to uh, 13 participants. So this supports up to 13 participants, right? So this is uh, smart gallery features for you. So the next feature which I'm going to show you now is audio tracking feature, right? So let me just enable audio tracking first and then I'll show you that feature. Give me a moment. Okay, so if you can see audio tracking mode is enabled. I started to speak now, so I'm not doing anything. I'm not controlling the remote. The camera tracks me automatically. As soon as I started to speak, it recognized where the voice is coming from and then it focuses on me, right? So I have my colleague sitting next to me, so I'm going to invite him to talk and then you can see the camera will track him. Can you please? Hi, hello, how are you? There you go. He just, uh, he just said, uh, hi, hello, how are you? I mean, it is, it is not even uh, uh, two seconds. So it just uh, track where the audio is coming from and it focused on him immediately, right? So let me uh, just change my position. Maybe I'll go to a go to a different location and then I'll talk. You can see the camera will uh, track me accordingly. So now I'm in a different location now. You can see the camera position by itself and then it focuses uh, to my face, I mean to my uh, frame and where the where the audio is coming from right so the, the camera focus me automatically so again i'm in a different location now so i'm standing a little far from the camera still the camera can track where the audio is coming from right so i request him to talk again hi hello how are you so as soon as he started to speak the camera tracked him automatically so this is audio tracking for you 
The next feature I'm going to show you now is presentation mode. So presentation mode is a little different feature which is not there in um, other brands. So to enable the presentation mode, you will have to have some exercises. So you will have to have multiple presets. So this camera supports up to 10 presets. So let's say you have two presets. If the voice comes from that particular preset, the camera will trigger that position. So for example, I have two presets which already uh, which has already been set in this uh, conference room. So I'm going to enable that presentation mode. So I'm going to talk from one preset location to another preset location. So you can see how the camera behaves, right? So just give me a moment. Let me just enable the presentation mode and then go to that particular preset and I talk. So this is uh, preset number one. So I am standing at the preset number one area. So if you see, the camera has automatically triggered the preset number one. So this is preset number one actually. So I am speaking in this area and the camera trigger this particular location, right? So I am going to go to preset number two now. Now you can see uh, the camera will jump into preset number two. So I am standing at preset number two now. Right? So you can see this is the this is the preset already I have done it. So this is preset number two. So even if I go to preset number one or preset number two, the frame is going to be like this. So the zooming, uh, uh, the zoom in what I've done is this much, right? So preset number two will be like this. And then when I talk from preset number one, it will be like this. So this zoom. So you can see the zooming difference. At preset number one, the zooming is little bit out. And then the preset number two has little zoomed in. So what if I speak from a different location which is not there in preset number one and preset number two? You can see that. So now I'm not there in preset number one or preset number two, but still the camera is focusing to me, but the camera did not focus, you know, as much as it focused in preset number one and preset number two, because this is an audio tracking mode now. So as soon as I come out of preset number one or preset number two, the camera goes to audio tracking mode and you can see the frame now, right? So you can have 10 number of uh, presets and you can enjoy this uh, uh, feature where you need it, right? So this is presentation mode for you. So finally, we are going to see true WDR feature. Let's see the experiment. This room is having poor lighting condition. So when I enable true WDR, you can see the room looks like this. Our Sony 4K True WDR sensor adapts to any lighting condition. So when I deactivate True WDR, it looks like this. And when I enable it again, it looks like this. It maintains excellent clarity in high contrast backlight environments. So that is True WDR for you. VB342 Pro is suitable for small rooms, medium rooms. I hope you enjoyed the demonstration of Aver VB342 Pro. Uh, for more doubts, clarification or inquiries, you can contact us. The information is given below. And the, for just for your information, the whole demo session has been recorded uh, using VB342 Pro. The audio and video is from VB342 Pro. And uh, please like, comment and share this video. Please do not forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you so much. Take care. Stay tuned.